So, this is paradise. If you can afford. Gentlemen, glad to hear you made it out of New York. Where are we? Olivia decrypted the data 47 recovered from the bank. We isolated three transactions from Providence partner accounts. All made out to Haven, a small corporation operating out of the Maldives. And what does Haven do? To the public, they specialize in reputation management for the rich and famous. The real money, however, comes from the covert reconstruction of identities for wealthy criminals. They make people disappear. The partners are using Haven to acquire new identities. Yes. Olivia's been attempting to hack the Haven servers, but the owners of Haven are manually resetting the access keys every 10 hours. That, unfortunately, makes them targets. Haven Island is a true tropical paradise. Owned by the company's founder, Tyson Williams, the island is used by Haven as a combined headquarters and client entertainment center. Current and potential clients are ferried to the island and treated to the very best the Maldives have to offer. Michelin star chefs, a full massage spa, private huts, exercise facilities, and all the comforts of a luxury island resort are made available to them. 47. We'll be sending you in as a potential new client. We've put together a convincing cover story. You're Mr. Reaper, a thief for hire looking to disappear for a while. Your mission on the island is simple. You need to eliminate the three owners of Haven. Tyson Williams, founder and rumored tyrannical CEO of Haven. Ludmilla Vitrova, a former confidence artist hired by Williams to serve as a client recruiter and handler. And Stephen Bradley, technical wizard and the brains behind Haven's proprietary software platform. With the owners gone, Olivia will be able to penetrate the Haven servers long enough for her to secure the new partner identities. I've uploaded all the information we have on the island and the three targets. Best of luck, gentlemen. Hmm. I don't rely on luck. Well, a little wouldn't hurt. And welcome already to another Roulette Rivals 7 console winners bracket round one match between Krudy and Derek. We're heading straight on in to Haven Island in just about 10 seconds. Spin will be arriving. Welcome everyone. I hope you are ready for the first ever Haven Island on the tournament uh, of the tournament. And it's gonna be a Tyson Williams Fiber Wire Kill as Tech Crew, Steven Bradley, Silenced Pistol as Resort Staff, and Lydon Livetrova. Loud SMG as Butler. Uh, that's a that's a lot of a lot of firearms in that spin. <laughs> um, Derek straight in uh, had starting in the um, the training training facility as a personal personal trainer has a seeker I think in inventory wants to seeker. Uh, Steven straight at the start here stream buffering a little bit. Um, I think he hit it. <laughs> the stream buffer made it a bit difficult to see whether Derek hit that or not. Um, yeah, meanwhile, Crudy still planning, currently looking at a Villa Pier start, smuggling in an SMG, uh, bringing a crowbar, I think, and other stuff. Ooh. Derek. Derek Secret Ludmilla is searching now, so maybe somebody got panicked a little bit there and is restarting now. Uh, he swapping out his snail for something else. I couldn't quite catch what it was. Meanwhile, Crudy loaded in. Um, and. Ah! <laughs> the butler. The butler is a uh, an enforcer. To the to the villa staff, he tried coin luring him behind the couch using a banana for an accident KO. Um, but yeah, 
the the bump Rudy made the butler notice him because the butler is an enforcer for Villa staff. Um, so both players on one restart so far. Let's see, Crudy turning on the gramophone. Uh, we'll get the interest of a mansion staff now. Meanwhile, Derek successfully secured both Ludmilla and Steven. Is looking to KO Ludmilla in this hut now. Um, needs to be careful of the windows now, however. <laughs> kind of didn't lock on with his crowbar. That's a KO. Hopefully, nobody sees that body. Oh, or this body. Or anybody here. Um, currently, is still fine. He's still green for the time being. Meanwhile, Crudy. Working on clearing out the uh, bottom level of the mansion, however, gets spotted outside from outside, KOing one of the bodyguards. Um, that will be a restart from him. Giving a slight advantage to Derek, who is now lagging it over to Stephen Bradley, I assume, to KO him as well. To have uh, the two targets isolated. Which would work very well in his favor. And Crudy is changing up his loadout a little bit. There is the Steven KO from Derek. Uh, red guns, however, won't be an issue because it's just the target. Uh, he'll has to have to deal with that for the remainder of the match, however. Uh, Crudy decided to start in the suit near the um, the the pool area is also now securing uh, Stephen Bradley could have done that from a from the personal trainer start however can't bring a briefcase with you from the personal trainer start I think that's what um, yeah may made him wanting to use a suit start Alright, Derek uh, is trying to obtain a resort staff by the looks of it, luring this guy in here. Hopefully it doesn't wall hack any of the other buddies in here. Uh, so picking up his silenced pistol would give him the Stephen Bradley kill. There's the throw. Oh, body flying a bit weirdly around. Meanwhile, Crudy in the same hut. Just a couple minutes earlier, basically also secret, secret both targets. Uh, now KO'd Ludmilla. Will hide this bodyguard and then leg it over to Steven to KO him as well. And then they are pretty equal in setup in terms of setup. Uh, Derek just having the slight advantage, of being a couple minutes in faster. Uh, Crudy, however, realizes he needs a resort staff, ga grabs that instantly instead of having to go back and forth. Bit of server lag for Derek, who now got the silenced pistol resort staff kill. Stack al allowed to walk in in the villa? Mm, uh, I don't think so. Uh, maybe ground floor, but definitely not top floor. Um... But I don't, I don't actually think it's ins allowed inside the villa at all. Just the outside. Um, however, there are numerous options uh, of getting Tyson. Obviously, it's a live kill, so it's a bit more difficult. Um, depending on the amount of setup you're willing to do. Meantime, Crudy caught up nicely. Didn't need to go back and forth once more and uh, now also grabbed the resort staff silenced pistol kill on Steven Bradley. And uh, yeah. Uh, 
is gonna make his way over to the mansion as well as, as well it seems Derek took care of the cameras that's one less thing to worry about for him um, he now however needs to get a tech crew basically up here um, because well he can't can't just KO can't just KO Tyson see what his plan is in the meantime Crudy also arriving at the mansion um, routing wise this makes perfect perfect sense I think tech crew five wire is something that's available inside the mansion obviously so I assume both players are now gonna go for that and Butler disguise um, well something you need uh, you can only get inside the mansion but need outside of it so uh, makes sense to get that and then do the lit millicle last. Uh, Crudy looks to be doing a server lure, I think. He picked up a medic flower, going in through the basement, switched into a tech crew. Um, and with only Tyson up, would work a bit in his favor, I think. Derek's, Derek's stream is having, uh, having some difficulties here. I can try and reload it, but I'm not sure. It doesn't look like an issue on my end, to be fair. He is, however, luring people near the butler, it seems. Since the butler also one of the required disguises. While well, Crudy's just pulling out all the servers. Hello? Someone there? Hello? And Crudy has successfully done the server lure, quote unquote. He um Pulled out all the, all the servers, he medicked all the people down here. Now all he needs to do is get... Get Tyson effectively with the five wire. And then get the butler. Alright, meanwhile Derek working on the butler disguise. There is the one. Mansion staff round, and Derek has now an now has an audio lure on the butler. Crudy did indeed KO Ludmilla. He KO'd both of the targets. Steven already dead. Uh, doesn't have his target HUD enabled, um, or is set to permanent. Something. Maybe we can remind him of, or the match admin can remind him of during the break. Right. Bit of patient waiting from both players right now. But Derek, I think, just got the butler. Has him boxed up. Yes, there it is. Butler's disguise, so that's technically his second kill already. Just needs his loud SMG and needs to get to Ludmilla. Um, here comes Tyson for Crudy, however. Audio lure got his attention. His guard currently nowhere to be seen. That's the fiber wire as tech crew. Uh, that body is hidden there, I assume. If he just, he just, 
I just left that somebody lying there, so I assume it's fine. Um, yeah, all Crudy has to do now is basically get the get the butler, and he will be fine. Mm, however, I think he's gonna be trespassing in just a second here. Ooh, no, it seems like the uh, tech crew is actually allowed on the ground floor of the mansion. I thought it was only it was not even allowed in allowed in ground floor, but apparently it is. Ooh, and Derek getting caught trespassing. It's caught trespassing in. I think that's Luke Miller's bedroom or something even where Tyson is searching for something. That's a big restart from Derek. Swapping out his loadout a little bit. Meanwhile, Crudy got the coin trail on the butler. Just needs him to step over to that delicious banana peel. And this should be it. Yeah, there he is. Fell to his KO. <laughs> and Crudy has the butler's disguise. All he needs to do is leg it towards Luke Miller. Uh, he should have his SMG there. And he should be able to exit the storm is rising on Haven Island so it's as soon as you KO or kill two of the targets. Derek sticking with the strat secret, Steven securing Ludmilla. However, by the looks of it, um, sadly the rip costs him a bit too much here. Since Crudy is rapidly approaching Ludmilla. Uh, I guess it will depend a bit if he has a silence SMG. Eh, not silence, but loud SMG actually right here. I think he does. But if he doesn't, that is going to throw him back a little bit. Um, however, I think he dropped an SMG or his SMG even. Here earlier. Needs to take care of these buddies, however. This is a bit of a wall hacky area. So he needs to be really careful with this. That's a body drag where you can can go red, I think. Anything inside these huts can make you go red in almost instantly, if you like. Yeah, there's his uh, briefcase with sounds SMG. He is red guns right now. When did Crudy get red? There's the kill, but his green guns didn't get restored. No, that's a crime notice. Wow. Somebody Somebody must have seen him either drag Ludmilla or drag the other guard. That's the thing with these huts. They are so see-through. Um, jet ski, possibly. Huts are so see-through from all sides, including like the non-glass areas. Uh, and that has now... Put Crudy back a lot. So he needs to start basically from new. Uh, we'll stick with the strat, it seems like. Let's see if that pays off for him. Meanwhile, Derek also sticking with the strat. Basically, both players currently doing something very similar, at least for the start. Securing both Ludmilla and Steven, KOing them. Um. Then Yeah. Go and dealing with the mansion and Tyson. Let's see how they if they ch decide to change something up or how they're gonna avoid their mistakes. Uh last approach or the inconsistencies in Haven I suppose or something. You could also call call it like that. Let's see. Crudy 
taking care of Ludmilla's personal guard. Uh, since Derek, I think Derek's already on his way back towards Steven. Um, this costs, uh, costs Crudy a bit of time here. He goes to Steven, then goes back to Ludmilla to grab the uh, resort staff disguise, I think. When also this is it's kind of a tricky situation for Derek here. Steven has finished puking. And he needs to be quick about this. Hopefully nobody heard that. Oh, it's a close combat hurt, however. Will anybody come to investigate? Currently doesn't seem like it. Oh, but there are panicked NPCs. Oh, and there's a guard who's also enforcing... As of right now, Derek is not. It's by himself. Maybe the woman. Yeah, the woman could have seen. Buddy and also Crudy made it a tiny bit too late. I think or got ripped, ripped by the guard, uh, the personal bodyguard off. Seemed badly. That's synced restart. From both of them. Both, yeah, having an another another go at this. Almost twenty minutes into the map, however, that's Haven for you. Does take a bit with the three targets and the spaced out and map being bullshit sometimes. Um, or having wall hacky areas that can screw you over at any second. See, Crudy, Crudy missing his. This time he missed a secret shot. Last time he got spotted. Currently not working out entirely for him. Um, needs to keep his cool a little bit. And yeah, now he now they truly got a secret shot done, I think, and is running towards Lidmilla, same as the last couple of attempts. Uh, players sticking with their strats, no major currently, not like big, big changes. Um assume there will be some changes later on in the run, but the start worked for both of them, so why change it? Derek returning in personal bo uh, in personal trainer again, not taking the extra second to grab resort staff, however, for his timings also um it's already Almost missing Steven anyways. So I'm not sure if he thinks or realizes that he has the time to grab the extra disguise here. That's uh, the two KOs and Steven Bradley and Ludmilla Vitrova both KO'd for Derek. Crudy in the meantime. Uh, taking care of Ludmilla in this little little front room area. Um, not letting her go to the bathroom at all. Good today, sir. Maybe this area works better for him. Uh, let's see, Crudy, however, takes his time here. To grab that resort staff. Hopefully he still makes it in time for Steven. Made it in his uh the one run that where he was got all the way to the end. Um, let's see, he's holding instinct to see 
where or how if Steven is still puking and he just finished up is walking out he needs to be really care uh, really quick about this now Ooh, and he might might have an issue here doesn't have any more seeker shots let's see how crudy if crudy wants to try and salvage this or if he's gonna restart pausing a uh, shortly here thinking you know that's another restart missing the timing on Steven not something you wanted to deal with. Derek, in the meantime, again working on clearing out the mansion. Uh, didn't get the Steven kill immediately here. Not, that's, that's nothing time crucial, I think. Uh, it's just a bit of running back and forth. Needs to grab the resort staff, which is near Ludmilla, and then go to Steven and shoot him in the head can do that at any point basically uh, however he'll have to deal to live with red guns for now because Steven saw him KO him or his guard rather so that will be Maybe a bit unfortunate for him because well if you already have those red guns it can be a bit more difficult just to, to figure out uh, whether you went red or are still fine. Derek juggling a villa or mansion staff and the butler here. Got the butler behind this little wall now. Needs to make sure he doesn't get spotted from the outside KOing. And the guard is walking. Yes, he knows this. There's the throw. The drag looks like he's fine. Let's hope, hope that he is. Gets the butler's disguise. I wonder if he's now going to go and get the Ludmilla kill. By the looks of it, he's exiting the mansion again. So he might just save the Tyson kill for the very, very last. And uh, Crudy changed up his strategy a bit. It seems. I think he took care of Ludmilla just standard, but didn't seek her Steven earlier. And now got him on his way exiting the gym. And uh, will, I guess, KO him in this little side room where he'll walk through together with his guard. There he is. Uh, or he just lets him pass, but I guess he will definitely take care of his guard in here. Or not, <laughs> but it's fine. Green guns target isolation for two targets for Crudy now. Uh, not in the resort staff disguise, so can't just can't get this kill just yet. However. It's two targets. KO'd. Derek arrived at Ludmilla in the butler. Uh, wonder... Is not killing her immediately. Wants to get his resort staff first. Maybe smart to have a disguise ready that you can swap into and run out. Um... 
There's the KO. However, that's also one more buddy you have to take care of in terms of hiding. Um, and well, he could be spotted at any point in time right now. This is crudely breaking the rule by not having target HUD on all the time. Um, I think technically, yes. Um, I guess he will be reminded of that after the after Haven, as it's not. Was without a Derek getting. Loud SMG on with Milovitrova. Even nobody, nobody even heard that kill. Quickly dumped her anyways. Uh, is gonna switch into the resort staff here. Um, and I assume go run and get Steven. While Crudy on the other side is uh, doing the server lore. Or preparing it rather, medicking all the staff down here. I'm gonna start pulling out servers. That's the second kill for Derek. Technically, right now he's two kills up since I think uh, Crudy currently doesn't have any kills. However, he has basically all of them set up. Derek is back to green guns. Um, however, the hardest kill in this spin, and I think almost any Haven spin, Tyson Williams is still up. Um, he pulled out the plugs on all the servers. Will, or has gotten Tyson's attention, I think. And we'll wait and uh, prepare for him. Derek switching back, in, back into the butler. This guy is allowed inside the mansion, so he doesn't have to deal with any trespassing, trespassing issues. Um... I wonder I wonder what Derek's approach for Tyson will be now. Since it is a live kill in a tech crew disguise, tech crew not allowed the upper floor of the mansion. Crudy's plan of server luring him down. By worrying him in this corner has worked previously. Um, Tyson <laughs> is taking a sweet, sweet time for Crudy, however. Oh, and that's a body found for Crudy. And that is red guns. That's a restart for Crudy. 16 minutes only remaining on the timer. And, uh, well, in terms of Haven, the time is getting tighter and tighter. As we can see, Derek, 12 minutes in game, 16 minutes on the timer. If Derek were to restart now, he could get, probably has only a few more attempts at fully completing the spin with this strategy. Otherwise, he'd have some serious speeding up to do. Um... If Crudy, I didn't catch Crudy's in-game time uh, on his last attempt. But, yeah, any Haven spin will most likely be around 10 minute mark. Uh, or most Haven spins, I guess. There are always, of course, exceptions. Right, so yeah, clock is ticking, however, especially right now, both players have to remain calm, have to stick to what is working for them. 
which in Kudi's case is almost entirely worked out twice for him now. Just small inconsistencies, um, I guess, that has ruined his run both times. Um, Derek took care of Tyson's bodyguard. He's taking care of the other god in the cinema, and Crudy is getting hunted from KOing Ludmilla. Somebody saw that. That is more precious seconds ticking down. Currently, by the looks of it, Derek looks like he wants to take care of Tyson in the cinema. Uh, however, he still needs to get up here in a tech crew disguise, uh, which is not the hardest to obtain. There is one just waiting for your proximity um, in the the outside entrance to the underground lab. Oh, crew triggered a, triggered a target lockdown. The, the seeker shot was heard, I think. How long does Tyson spend in the cinema? Not that long, just a couple of seconds. Or like a minute or something. And that's another reset for Crudy. Derek didn't go for the fairly easy... Um, basically at this point, basically free... Tech crew. Collecting pamphlets. Just making sure he is informed about... Haven Island. Trying to lure one of these tech crew. Gonna be a long chain lure for him then. Just looking around for an easier option. Uh, down here, I guess getting tech crew is not actually that easy. I don't know. I never tried getting one down here. Also, Derek needs to be, like, make sure he gets, he lures a male tech crew. Since, well, can't take the disguise of a female. Um, this guard is now connected. This, this tech crew is not, does not want to, like, Listen to Derek's distractions. Don't worry, mm. He needs to make sure he doesn't mistake gas suit for tech crew. Those two are not the same disguise. He will KO this. Uh, Mansion guard, and I wonder. Just opening saves. Ooh, I, will, I hope, I really hope he's not thinking about. Oh no, he picked up a banana. Okay. So I assume now his plan is going to be to use that banana. On one of the workers. Would you mind going to see what it is? Okay, okay. To get their disguise. This guy's walking here. I'm gonna place the banana. There he falls. Bit hidden. Behind the stuff there has Derek has the tech crew disguise now. He's got ten minutes now. To get to Tyson Williams. Uh, he's isolated the cinema, however, he still needs to get there, which is not 
the easiest thing in the world, I think, in a trespassing disguise. Not impossible, but also not the easiest. Um... Let's see what his plan is. He's allowed here. Bottom floor. But I think as soon as he's gonna... Yep, there he is trespassing. Top floor. Somehow needs to get Tyson Williams alone. So outside upstairs, I don't think it's gonna help him. Is he still? Oh no, it's it's some of these weird trespassing zones where he's like trespassing sometimes, but the other times, I think if he's gonna go around the back, um, he will be he will be trespassing again or something. Um, uh, I'd be looking to. Ooh, just getting Tyson here would be. Pretty ballsy. Oh no, and our stream is buffering. Uh, there it is again. Getting whoosh from the outside. That's. Whew, that's an almost full whoosh. Has saved it, however. Tyson is entering the cinema again. He would be alone in there. Oh, that's... Will that impact notice the body found for Derek? However, that was the accident. The accident, uh, KO. Banana peel of the tech crew downstairs. Uh, Derek, in the meantime, had a couple of attempts has killed Stephen Bradley, has isolated Ludmilla, and uh, is making his way to the mansion um, in an attempt to get Tyson again. I think uh, I would think he still he sticks with the. Uh, with the man uh, server lure. Oh yeah, also true butler of the disguise that he needs to to get somehow. Oh, Tyson going downstairs for Derek right now. Not too sure what Tyson's plan right now is. Uh, Tyson seems a bit lost, however, downstairs is generally better for... Oh, he went, goes into his secret office for some reason. This is the perfect opportunity for Derek right now. Not sure why he is here. He is not in a... in a lockdown slash panic state. Now he's on stairs, most dangerous opponent of 47. Ooh, but there is the prompt, the fiber wire, and Derek. Oof. Oh, teleported up into the, <laughs> to the secret office again. Took him. Very bit, yeah. Some serious effort, but in the end, looks like Derek will go out victorious. On. Haven Island. <laughs> There's the exit prompt. Green guns. We should see five stars. SA in a couple of seconds. Meanwhile, Crudy is doing again server lure, which worked for him previously as well. There he is, Derek. Winning Haven Island. Coming up next is not Haven Island, but John King. Deed and uh, what a haven, what a spin. Um, however, nothing decided quite yet. Um, 
we do have another map coming up. At least one more. This haven was picked by Crudy. Um, who was very close to finishing twice as well. In the end, sadly couldn't make it. Uh, we will be going now to Chongqing, however. Which is Derek's pick. Um, so yeah, let's have a quick break and look at the mission briefing for Chongqing. Look closer. I'm telling you, the file is trash. The Constant doesn't so much burn his bridges as blow them up. Arthur Edwards, whoever he was, don't exist anymore. His personal data somehow deletes itself from any system that records him. Way beyond advanced. The partners spared no expense to make sure their controller would be untraceable. How untraceable? Look, I did what you asked, but Gray's gone and I'm no Diana. I'm not who you need right now. You gotta be kidding me. I see, eh? I used every encryption known to man. Who are these guys? the best. It's only a matter of time before they get lucky. We need to take them down. You and which army? I know where the agency stores its files, mission reports, client data. If we leak it to the public. You want to whistleblow the ICA? It's the path of least resistance. Turns out you are who I need right now, Olivia. I do this and I'm out. So, what are we breaking into? Data facility in Chongqing, China. Run by a man called Hush. Of course. The ICA site in Chongqing houses the agency's data storage and analyst division. Needless to say, security is daunting. The state-of-the-art server vault is biometrically wired to the facility's two overseers. Imogen Royce, behavioral analysis pioneer, and Hush, a data security guru with a taste for fringe transhuman experimentation. Tell me about Hush. A former cyber terrorist for the Ministry of State Security in Kedanyang, who fled his country after one of the Po regime's periodic purges. He made a career doing cybersecurity for dark web deplorables, human traffickers, organ harvesters, scum like him with no code or conscience. ICA sure can pick them. No offense. Can you disable security? A dual authentication protocol ensures that any handling of data must be directly authorized by Hush and Royce. The proverbial human factor device to make the system impenetrable. Luckily, I found a loophole. If both overseers should unexpectedly die within a short space of time, the system reverts to a temporary fail-safe protocol, which I can bypass. Take them off the board, and you'll have free access to the data core. And I'll handle the rest. And you're sure it'll work? Look, I know, Hush. If I'm wrong, we won't live long enough to regret it. All right. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome back to the second map of the Road Rivals 7 console winners break around one match between Crudy and Derek after a very spectacular haven. We are back with Chongqing. Um, in just about a minute, the second spin of the match will arrive. This map was picked by Derek, who is up to zero. So if he can win chunking right now he will t win this match 4-0 if Crudy can strike back tied out to a 2-2 two -two. um, we go to a third random map and uh, same will actually happen if this is a tie since in the case of a tie both players will be awarded one point and then will be the score will be one to three and uh, as you can read, it is a first to four. That would mean um, we go to yet another map. All right.
right. Oops. <laughs> Forgot to mute my WhatsApp. What else is new? Um. Anyways, Chongqing spin arriving. It's gonna be Hush with a pistol as a block guard, and Imogen Royce with five wire as facility guard. This ought to be a quick one, however. Um, disguises basically right next to the targets. Uh, the pistol, which is basically free, five wire, which is like it's a live kill, but apart from that, basically free. Um, you just have to bring it in. I think I don't think there is any um, any fiber wire on map. Uh, could be world record spin as we saw during the countdown. World record is currently four minutes something. I think held by Coates, the Chong King God, and uh, both players in guns blazing. Starting block guard, taking care of the evidence. Uh, running up. Okay. Ooh, Derek. Subduing. Subduing Hush. Oop, and uh, Mogwai gets another subdue on Hush, really enough. Uh, oh, but. I think got a body found or something needs, needs to restart here. It's gonna. Opt for a crowbar to well have a a K-O-ble or a, a melee weapon, a non-lethal melee weapon is what I wanted to say. Meanwhile, Crudy got the um, the hush kill done nicely. Is running down. Did shoot a drone or did not? I think he shot a drone. But, uh... Yeah, the question will be if Imogen is on lockdown. Or not. Since that was something that changed recently. Or, I guess not recently, but... Uh, in a patch that Imogen can go on lockdown. Um... If you do something to her while she while they are talking to each other, um, Crudy got hush now this time. And Imogen is moving. Uh, Derek got hush. Sorry, and uh, Imogen is moving for Crudy. Um, this is just a tiny bit of waiting for Crudy's side here. Waiting for that guard to go all the way up to the stairs. Need to be careful of the lady coming in from the other entrance. As she could be enforcing him here or see this disguise swap. Oop, and that is exactly what happened. That lady not remembering the code, uh, even though it's been 0118 or something ever since game launch. Still can't remember it. And she comes down to the facility after some time and ripped Crudy here. Saw the guys change. Now it's anger. Crudy. Not, not having a lot of luck on the aim for the camera box. And that gives the advantage now over to Derek, who got the um, the hush kill. Ooh, bullet distracts for Imogen. Interesting. Well, I guess not Imogen, but the, the bodyguard. Blacked the window. Uh, gonna grab the disguise here in this corner. Very nice. Needs the fiber wire kill. He has his fiber wire. He needs to be careful of the same lady over. And she, and now I'm not sure the guards on the other side of the corridor are gonna see him. Yeah, I think I think he's gonna play the patient game here and wait. Um, obviously, it's gonna put him out of a world record reach. However, uh, yeah, this, this is definitely more safe. Waiting for her to get to the top of the stairs. 
his uh, elevation. Because enemy of 47 gets the 5 war I kill. Uh, thought about running down and getting dongle exit. Ever is gonna run up and go to scooter. And it looks like this match will be a 4 0 victory for Derek. He's currently green guns. Nobody's lying around. There's the exit, the finish popping up in uh, just over five minutes. Derek has done it. Five stars SAS per requirement and is taking this match for zero. However, it's not nearly as close or it, it it's not nearly as um, not close. <laughs> Yeah, definitely a exciting match is what I wanted to say here. Crudy, lots of opportunities to um, to win the game, just screwing him over here and there. Just tiny mistakes that in the end cost him the match here. However, Crudy, uh, Crudy Derek, God, get confused with names now. <laughs> Very strong player on both maps and uh, is gonna move on in the brackets this was a console bracket round one match um crudy and derek derek moves on to round two to face the winner of kenny z versus nezuko chan while crudy's tournament run is not over entirely just yet drops down to the lower bracket and it's going to face the loser of match number six, which is the uh, just aforementioned match. And uh, yeah, it still has the possibility of um, making it to the grand finals in the end. Um, we also have some upcoming matches. Of course, in fact, there is a match starting in basically five minutes. Um, it is Matty Spice versus Pinwer playing Sapienza and Paris. Uh, no shortcaster on there just yet, however, um, some random person will be shoutcasting this match for us. I'm gonna send all of you over in a couple of seconds here. Uh, we've got a stacked evening ahead of us. Uh, two matches at 21 o'clock Central European time. Champion Air vs. Volvo Motors playing Santa Fortuna and Paris. Toby Norton vs. Joe the Baby Grabber playing Paris and Mendoza. Um, and later tonight, 22 o'clock Central European time, Max Masters playing Oh Shit Man on Mumbai and Little Creek. And at 1 a.m. tomorrow morning, Barbecue vs. Mika. At 3 a.m., The Buff Guy vs. Script Desk. Um, and at 8 a.m., Zaruin vs. Purple Key playing Double Chong King. Um, and yeah, all of these matches in your local time zones on hitmaps.com. Uh, so you don't have to do any of that fancy calculation if you're not living in Europe or Central Europe. Um, yeah, and I think at this point, all I have left to say is uh, thank all of you for watching. Um, thanks to the two players, obviously, for playing. Congratulations again to Derek for winning this match. Um, thanks to Chromex for c admitting this match for us. And let's see if Rani is has gone live yet. No, apparently not. Then I will just stall for a couple more uh, seconds and uh... ah, all right he is live no more stalling haha <laughs> uh, I will just go ahead and raid some random person uh, so all of you can enjoy the Maddie Spice versus Pinor match in which is starting in just three and a half minutes so yeah thanks everyone for watching and see you there